Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to a brand new vlog. If you're new, what's up? My name is Ivy, and if you're not, welcome back to the channel. I haven't done my hair yet, but I did get ready for the day. If any of you guys have one of these, how do you clean them? I think I need to Google a video on how to clean this thing because I don't want gunk stuck in here because obviously they are like hot bristles. Yesterday I had a little bit of a rough day. I don't know why I was just feeling really anxious. So today I figured let's turn it around. I posted another video today and I'm feeling really good about it. I feel good about like getting back on a routine and honestly I think yesterday I was just having kind of a rough one and I had to like take a step back which is fine. I feel like a lot of us don't talk about the fact that Sometimes we need to take a step back just for ourselves and for our mental health and that's okay. I'm not going to be perfect every single day. I'm not going to be 100% cheery every single day. I feel like I was just overwhelmed with obviously the move is coming up, just life is changing, things are changing, things are different now. I've been shooting a lot of TikToks today which I'm happy about because I try to delegate like, whenever I'm feeling like shooting specific content, I really try to, like, dive into that. I'm excited because we are going to do the Hot Air Balloon Festival. I already know you guys know that this is happening, but we're going on Saturday. I really thought today was Friday, but it's only Thursday. I actually have a workout set that, well, I want to film a haul on TikTok of a couple things that I got off Amazon so I'm gonna do that today I'm obviously today is like a work day I want to do a full-on like work a day content shoot vlog I showed you guys this stuff yesterday but honestly I was not in the mood I talked about it earlier I tried to vlog and it just wasn't happening so I just stopped which is fine. I did a haul of all the things that I recently got on Amazon. Also, I need to insert a clip in here because last week I went to Ulta and Target and I forgot to input the footage. So after I give you a haul of this stuff, I'll input that footage of all the things that I got so you guys can still see the haul even though it is from the past. This is actually my favorite bodysuit brand on Amazon. I love the texture. I love how soft the material is. It's just an all-around good brand. This is Reoria. I already have a bodysuit exactly like this. It's just a nude, but I got a plain black one. And then you guys yesterday saw on Instagram that I got two of these tops. These kind of go like this. Like, they're one of these. I'll put one on to show you because I think I decided I'm going to... Go to different locations and kind of film TikToks and maybe a couple pictures, but I got a brown one. Again, you guys saw all of this on Instagram, so if you guys don't follow me over there and you want to, you can go, but I got that. And then I got an orange one. This is very like out of my comfort zone, I feel, but I love the color and I've been seeing a lot of like other Latinas wear brighter colors and I feel like it would look so good on my skin tone and a lot of you guys said the same thing because I think the color was just throwing me off because I'm not used to wearing like super bright colors but I feel like they looked really cute on me. I'm gonna actually try these on in a little while. I'll show you guys what the brown one looks like just with my shorts and then I also got a matching workout set like a biker short type of set and I haven't tried it on yet so... Let's do that together. We are finally going to do a haul of all the things I got at Ulta. I got this at Target. Um, this is the Skin Paradise from L'Oreal. I actually have it on today. And it feels nice. It is a water-infused tinted moisturizer. And I feel like it looks good. You guys let me know. This stuff I got at Ulta yesterday. So I did get this Makeup Revolution eye brightening illuminating under eye concealer but I had heard that people were using this as a Charlotte Tilbury dupe because it has like the same little applicator as you can see I used it today but I tried this out so that's what like I have on for like a little bit of 
bronzer. I feel like I look really dark compared to like what I actually look like. I think that's a little bit better. But I put, I use this as bronzer in a darker shade. This is just in the shade Caramel. So I got that. Gold brush. This is from Morphe because I've been wanting to do like brown eyeliner, like winged liner. So I got this little angled brush. Deluxe buffer brush. So I thought either this would be good for foundation or for like my bronzer just to kind of like buff it out this nyx lip liner it's in a brown shade the line loud lip pencil it is in total baller and this is like an actual pencil Ooh, wait that's so creamy i decided i wanted to show you guys some of my favorite bodysuits from amazon this brand is amazing and no this isn't sponsored i literally just love them that much Honestly, they remind me of like a Skims dupe, so let's jump into it. This is the first one. I've never tried out a bodysuit with this like cut before. I actually got another color as well, but I love the way it fits. It definitely cinches you in. It will make you look snatched for summer, and I think I'm obsessed with like the color. This one's in the color coffee, and I love I got one in orange. It's literally the exact same cut as the other one. I love how this looks on me. I feel like it really complements my skin tone. I feel like it's a good fit. I, again, I love the cutout. I feel like it's just something that adds a little flair to your outfit. I mentioned all of these on Instagram, so if you guys don't follow me on there and you want to, you can go over there. But I love this. The next one is more of a basic, but still a solid choice if you guys have been looking for some new fashion favorites from Amazon. This one, on the other hand, is just your basic black bodysuit, but I feel like it goes with everything. It's square neck. I feel like square neck tops really complement my body and my shape. If you guys have been looking for any like new summer favorites or just honestly something that you feel like is going to suit you and you can take from day to night, I would highly suggest these. This is not sponsored by any means. I am just a stand for these because I love the material. They're soft on the skin. It's not like cotton material where you feel very like draggy. Do you understand what I mean? Anyways, I hope you guys have an amazing day. Let me know which one was your favorite. This is what the top looks like with my shorts. I just wanted to show you how it fit. A lot of you guys really, really liked this. I think I like it a lot better with shorts. Yesterday when I tried it on, I tried it on with dark pants and I feel like that throw throwed the outfit off a little bit, but it's so cute. Now I'm gonna try on the orange one just to show you guys. It literally looks exactly the same, just in orange. I think it's gonna take a little getting used to just because I'm not used to like this type of cut on me but I feel like it flatters me and also these bodysuits do so 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 well at just cinching everything in so if you guys have been looking for like a solid bodysuit and low-key I've heard that they're like skims dupes go for this one Y'all are seeing a little behind the scenes because I decided I I actually knew I was going to do a TikTok on these already. So I'm putting a t-shirt over so that I can like do the TikTok and that's the vibe right now. I have decided I'm going to go do a content shoot but I did want to like retouch up some of my makeup and make sure it looks good because I'm going to be taking a couple pictures. I figured I wanted to take a picture in this new shirt that I got. I tried on the set that I got and honestly I didn't like it. I tried on like the the workout set and I don't know if I'm going to keep it. I feel like the top, like my boobs are too big for the top, honestly. So I figured I'm probably going to return that to today hopefully but i want to deepen up my eyes just a little bit because i feel like i never really play with my makeup too much i used to do it all the time but i feel like now i'm just like i want to get it done and like be productive for the rest of my day so i'm like deepening it deepening it up just a little bit in the outer corner i just want to take some pictures I feel like I've been very productive today getting a lot of like content things done 
So I figured since I'm in a good mood, let's go take some photos. And I can just take my time, listen to music on my way there. But honestly, I'm like really feeling this top. I'm glad that I kept it and I'm glad that even though I was in a funk yesterday, I didn't let that like dictate like, oh my God, I hate this. Because normally that's what I would do. So I'm happy that you guys gave me your opinions on Instagram. So shout out to all of you who messaged me about my top. We're almost ready. I'm going to redo my hair, make sure it's like super straight. I don't know if any of you have this issue. Like my hair, and I don't know what it is. It will never get, I have to sit here for like 45 minutes for it to get really straight. So I have to really take my time with it. I'm sticking with this outfit. I have shorts on. I tried those other pants on that I really love that have like more white of a leg but the light wash didn't look good with the with this top so I figured we'll just keep the shorts on I'll figure out like what kind of pose I want to do I also like I said I want to film some TikToks so it's an all-around content shoot day today I've actually gotten a lot done today though and I'm really proud of myself because yesterday I told you guys I was not in it. So I'm glad that I took time for myself to relax and now I can jump back into everything with a positive mindset instead of just being like stressed out. I'm gonna get everything together so I need like this tripod. I think I might leave it at full length just because that's easier for me when I get to where I'm going to shoot my pictures. Don't forget this. I have a really bad habit of almost always forgetting like the little attachment for my phone because obviously I need that. And I think we're gonna be off after this. I'm literally just gonna throw on some shoes. I don't think you'll be able to see my shoes in the pictures, but I'll take some like cute sandals so that if I just wanna change it up, and jewelry. I think I'm going to take my content shoe bag because I feel like it's always easiest to just take the content shoe bag with me because then if I want to change my jewelry or literally any item, I can just like throw it on. We'll have to do a what's in my content shoe bag. I'm bringing an extra pair of pants, a oversized t-shirt, my go-to one actually, and then that black bodysuit that I showed you guys earlier just to make it easy. So we're gonna put all of this in the content shoe bag. A new place, a new home for a while. Let me feel alive. Nothing to hold me back. Take my time, just enjoy the ride. A new man passing by. Life is good, best I've ever felt. Back in the car, it's hot outside. I left the tripod out there, but I'm going to sit in here for a second, review the photos, see what I got, see if I got anything good. And then if I didn't, I will retake. Y'all, some of these are coming out so good. Wow. I needed a day like today. So this is also why I like bringing you guys on days like today when I'm working and shooting and putting stuff together because honestly like I was having a really off day yesterday and I not saying that this fixes everything but like it it gives you a good little boost to remember like who you are you know what I mean a good little confidence we love that Y'all, I don't know what it is, but people get so weird when they see you taking pictures of yourself. Like, so weird. They, like, stare at you. I had this car right before, like, a work truck came by was, like, staring at me, like, what is she doing? Like, it's really not that big of a deal. Honestly, I just wanted to come on and, like, talk to you guys for a second and say that... 
I spoke about it on Instagram yesterday. I think I talked to you guys about it. That yesterday I felt really anxious. I took a step back and today I hit the ground running. I started working back on like content stuff and TikToks and it honestly made me feel the best. First of all, that I let myself, not that I like make myself feel bad for taking a break, but sometimes I'm like, oh, I'm not doing this, I'm not doing that. I woke up yesterday at 6 a.m. and I did a whole bunch of stuff. I edited like a video, I did a thumbnail, I did all of this stuff. And normally that would make me feel very fulfilled. But yesterday I was just having an anxious day and that's okay. And today, I think because I let myself feel my feelings, normally I wouldn't do that. Normally I would just be like, okay, we can push through this, like we got this, whatever. And instead I really gave myself grace and I took a long nap after like working pretty much half the day. And then I watched Netflix with Trevor and I think giving myself that grace and giving myself like, okay, you don't have to do 12 million things in one day, it's okay made me feel a lot better and today I was ready to like take on the day so if any of you guys needed to hear that today I hope that you take this and like just give yourself a break because I know it's hard because a lot of us are like I want to be productive I want to get things done I want to do this but sometimes you really just need to take a step back and I love that and I love you guys so I'm gonna sit here, I'm trying to see what other TikToks I wanna make and then we will be heading home. Good morning, everybody. I have not vlogged this morning. I actually, even though I'm sitting in my bed right now, I have been working since 6.30. It's currently 10.30 right now. I woke up this morning and went to my office. I didn't vlog it just because I was sitting on the computer and you guys can only see me do so much when I'm sitting on the computer but I figured I haven't done one of these before and I know that some of you guys are interested in like what I do on my end like content shoot days or just like work days like when I say I'm always saying like oh working on this but I feel like you guys don't understand like what I'm like technically working on so I figured we would do a vlog together and make a work day or a work vlog I'm pro I don't know if I'm going to vlog the entire day or a couple days and just show you guys different things that I'm doing right now I'm actually taking a break because I finished editing you guys would have already seen this video that I edited today I finished editing a video and I was editing I don't know for like four hours I got that done. I uploaded two other videos that are going to be rendered. I have to make a thumbnail. I actually don't know why I don't have my planner. Actually, let's go grab that because I feel like this will make things a lot easier for me. Normally, when I flip on work mode, I write in my planner. I actually wrote some stuff yesterday that I had to do. I have to do one two technically three thumbnails for three different videos have to i have a lot of stuff so let's see what's on my schedule today is tuesday i have to take my books to the library i have to get that done edit vlogs i went ahead and edited a vlog this morning so that's technically off my list i have one more vlog that i have to edit edit a tiktok with footage from the vlog if you guys don't follow me on tiktok I sometimes post stuff from the vlogs earlier over there so if you want to follow me on there you can if you don't want to that's fine too I went ahead and downloaded that but I have to edit it in my app on my phone <laughs> what else do I have to do okay today I'm thinking do at least one thumbnail tomorrow or definitely tomorrow i should probably do that because i feel like that'll be less stressful i'm honestly just talking to myself at this point description on my video because that needs to get done because i'm uploading a video on thursday so i want to make sure that's getting done tomorrow i have like a lot of little random things that i have to do but like i said i never vlog like my work days so if you guys are interested I have a planner that I write everything down in or like if I have things that I need to work on things to shoot specifically 
I will write them down so that I know specifically when I want it done by. So on Thursday, I think I'm going to do... So this is basically what I do for a little while. Uh, since I've been working since around 6.30, I came into the room and kind of wanted to gather myself. I'm gonna sit here, watch a couple YouTube videos, and edit on my phone a couple things and TikToks that I am wanting to get up this week. bringing my laptop in here because I think I'm going to do a description for a video. I'm currently making a thumbnail on my phone. I am... This is what it's looking like so far. So you guys would have already seen this video. But this is what the thumbnail is looking like. I'm inputting like the pictures, making sure that it's going to look good and that's what i'm doing right now just trying to finagle this thumbnail so that it can be ready for when i want to upload which isn't going to be in a couple days for me so i'm just getting things together and kind of like creatively trying to just make my thumbnail hello you guys i haven't talked to you in a little while I went to the library, went to go return my books because they were overdue, and I did some work while I was not talking to you guys. I like to put like a couple videos on my TikTok of vlog stuff, so I made a new little thing. I can't play the song <laughs> because I'm pretty sure I'll get copyrighted, but if you want to go look at my TikTok, that's what it looks like. It's just a little overview of a vlog that I just posted so there's that if you guys like that type of content and I went ahead and finished the thumbnail for that video that I was talking to you guys about look I'll show you you guys would have already seen this thumbnail but this is what it looked like like finished up yeah that's what it came out looking like I'm actually really really happy with it because I just wanted stuff to be done basically I just wanted everything to be done so I was doing some of that work I'm going to edit another vlog I feel like I'm always editing but I am gonna start checking stuff off of my list my camera battery was dying so I had to replace that I'm gonna put this one to charge I always like having extra camera batteries because they come in handy let's where's my pen I'm like lost hello the, if you guys think like I'm this organized person I try really hard to be but like the office right now is not reflecting my brain or it is reflecting my brain it needs to reflect how I want my brain to be so on the to-do list it said take books to library now I get to check that off I don't know what I can show so those two are checked off I don't know Oh yeah, I can show you guys all of this stuff. It's nothing, like, schedule-wise. I also know that I have really, like, sloppy handwriting. I've always had sloppy handwriting. Uh, one of my counselors actually told me she thinks it's because, one, I'm dyslexic, and two, my brain works faster than my hands can write. So she's like, you just, like, want to get the words out so that you don't forget anything and I was like actually yeah that sounds like very accurate to me so I did at least one thumbnail for a video I got that done so that can be checked off edit a TikTok from footage from the vlogs I did that so I got all four things done that I wanted to get done today and it is only 150 so I don't think that's bad especially because I've been up for a really long time and I feel like I got a lot done in the short amount of time that I have been awake and vlogging. I have like a whole bunch of like, like living proof products, my Summer Fridays products. 
I need to look on my list. Today is like not a content shooting day. It is definitely like a let's get it together type of day. I also forgot to show you guys. My mom bought me some stuff. Well, Trevor obviously went to Dallas this last weekend. And my mom had bought me or found me quite a couple like gel nail polishes. This one came in this. But they're really pretty. They're like, like pink colors. So like the base colors that I normally use. She sent me over some so this one's like a mauve and I need to the only problem was one of them had like a I don't know if it's a crack but I need to figure out how to clean that and then she did find these Beatles ones this is gel nail polish and they're 12 colors but these are the ones that are for like stenciling and there's actually a lot in here some of them are missing but that's okay I think my mom only paid like three or four dollars for this but they're like the ones that have the really skinny tips so that we can do gel nail art like I'm sorry excuse me look at that freaking color it's so pretty it's like a like a coral I don't even know it's so pretty so shout out to my mom thank you mom I know you're, you're watching she watches like literally all of my vlogs shout out to mom for that I need if you guys have like a better way for me to store all my nail polishes please send me recommendations because my life is so chaotic right now so I would greatly appreciate if any of you had any recommendations I might actually ask on Instagram as well because you guys are so good about like getting back to me and be like hey use this or do this and i'm like oh my god why didn't i think about that i just want to show you guys like what my desk looks like right now and i keep in mind i am ashamed like this is like not okay i am not happy that it looks like this but this is like the reality of life right now it's like cluttered to the max like look i just i i literally can't like there's stuff everywhere now i need to connect where is my ow I don't know where anything is okay I think we're actually gonna clean my desk right now because I feel this is what I was looking for and it was underneath where I was writing yeah it's time for me to clean my desk like it's getting a little ridiculous so let's do that my nail is lifting a little bit so I honestly think it's time to say goodbye to these nails so I think I'm gonna go on Pinterest I you guys seem to really like when you vote for my nails so I'm gonna go on Pinterest see a couple options that I like and then we'll see what you guys choose guys these nails these right here are so pretty but I don't have little rhinestones to do that. But I think these are gorgeous. I feel like those would be so freaking cute to do. Let's see what you guys vote on because y'all be giving me all the good recommendations. All of the good options. I kind of, I'm kind of into like this creamsicle like nail type of vibe. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what... What you guys end up choosing i feel like ooh, these are kind of cute so many of my nails came off and i only have three left on this hand and then none on this one actually so i'm gonna try using this contraption that i bought at quick lots but i gotta figure out how to use this <laughs> in here I hope I'm doing this correctly. I've literally never used this thing before. But it's supposed to like steam off your nails. Do I have something from insulin coming in today? I don't think I do. Amazon just came by and Trevor said he ordered me something. I literally have no clue what this is because 
Obviously, I didn't order it. Oh, you bought me the bathing suits that were on my list. <laughs> that was fast. I had these bathing suits like on my like buy later or purchase later or whatever. But this is what it looks like. There's this bodysuit. It's just black. Hopefully, I like these. Um, there's this one. I'm like trying to make sure, it's trying to see how see-through this is. Cute. And then this one that's nude. It came in like a pack. And I will update you guys if I like these because obviously I'm not gonna recommend or link anything that I don't think you guys will like. This one actually goes like this. Oh wait, it is steaming. I think this actually might work. Okay, let's just leave them in there for a minute and see what it does.